The playoff picture is starting to take shape, and in 7A Region 4, just making the playoffs is never the goal. This Friday, the chance to host a postseason game is on the line as Sparkman and Bob Jones battle for second place in our game of the week. Right now, it's six teams in a, really in the hunt for four spots, and uh, you know, and every game here and out is, is crucial. Every week in our region's big, so uh, anytime you can get a win, it's a, a good thing. A week ago, Sparkman was the top dog, but the Senators suffered their first loss of the season as James Clemens took control of the region, becoming just the second team to even score against Sparkman in a 31-30 win. Uh, you know, Friday we just we, you know, just didn't execute well enough. This year, the Patriots' season started with three straight losses, but they haven't dropped a game since, and now sitting at 3-1 and one in the region, a win Friday could be just what they need. It meant a lot, you know, especially the way we started and the injuries we had to overcome and kind of the way our you know, coaches and players had to, you know, kind of reinvent ourselves a little bit to, to find a way to win. So it'll, it'll be a big moment. But either way, I'm proud of them still. But again, it's a game that I think if we go out there and execute, I think we can win. And while both squads are currently in position to make the playoffs, neither coach wants to play in the Magic City. Every win uh, just gets you closer to, you know, being able to uh, host a game uh, versus, you know, going down to Birmingham. Uh, this has put us, put us in a pretty good position to host a playoff game. So that's kind of what we're uh, trying to accomplish. For the last three years, the Sparkman and James Clemens game has been a battle of brothers with Leron White at Sparkman and Kelvis White at Bob Jones. But even though Leron is gone, the game still carries a lot of weight. I talked to him the other day, I told him he got to stay neutral now. He can't cheer for me, he can't cheer for, well, I wish he would cheer for me, but I know he would. <laughs> but he, you know, he, he, you know, he still loves Sparkman, you know, and uh, again, it's going to be a little different, but, you know, at the end of the day, we still got to go out and compete. We'll see how things stack up on Friday night at Madison City Stadium. Max Cohan, Way 31 Sports.